about your birthday, Brina? I know you have this super mysterious thing with your aunts you're not allowed to talk about. Welcome, daughter of night. But tell me the truth, whatever it is. Harvey, I can't. The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina is about this young half-witch, half-mortal Sabrina Spellman. She was raised by witches, but her life up until 16 was very mortal. And on her 16th birthday, she's faced with the decision of signing her name in the Book of the Beast. The path of night or the path of light. I want both. She's torn between two worlds that she loves. And what path is she going to create? I'm going to the Academy to learn how to defeat the Dark Lord. This show and the 90s show are vastly different. There's comedy in it. Penny dreadful for your thoughts, cousin? But it's dark. The great work begins. It's edgier, it's thrilling. It's very much in the horror vein. You're going to die, half-breed. So give the dark lord our best, won't you? What's amazing about this show is that these powerful women are unapologetic in their fierceness. <laughs> how fun. All of the different characters represent Sabrina's light versus dark nature and how they're all like intertwined together. When you're watching it, there will be at least one person that you'll go, oh, that's my favorite. Every shot and every set is just so perfect and really unique. The detail is magnificent. This show has changed the face of television. It's a beautiful experience all around. Aunt Zelda and I can make sure nothing bad happens to you. Everything about the show is so massive, but grounded and real, and there's something just next level dark about it. She shall abandon her mortal life immediately. There is another path for me. Sabrina is going to have to make hard choices along the way, and that is the hero's journey for her. Be ready for what is ahead. Dark Lord. I shall deliver Sabrina unto you. Sabrina. Aww. What's your name?